Hi, I'm Dr. Alec Nikolic and I'm going to take a closer look at textured or rough skin. Now, some of us might be unfortunate in that our skin, especially when we put our fingers or we touch the skin, it feels pretty coarse or rough. And this type of textured skin needs special care. Um, firstly, let's look at what the possible causes are. The number one culprit for a textured skin is UV exposure, sun damage. The second is as we get older, unfortunately, some of us will experience more rough or te textured skin. The second is free radical damage. That's basically environmental factors such as pollution, smoking, etc., which will have a direct damaging effect uh, on our skins. And unfortunately, some people that suffer from acne also have dry skin. Typically, acne is associated with oily and shiny skin, but there is a small proportion of people which actually get breakouts and blemishes and acne, but uh, suffer from dry skin. And that will have a different approach and treatment than the acne sufferers which have oily skin. And finally, um, some of us may have rosacea, which is also associated with a textured or a rough type skin. And also, uh, people that suffer from dry skin can also develop a rough textured uh, type of skin. Now, very simply, the treatment recommendation when it comes to textured skin is we need to use a good sunscreen, an SPF 30 or higher, and I'm a firm believer that our SPF needs to contain zinc oxide and or titanium dioxide, those are mineral type based sunscreens that reflect the, the harmful uh, UV lights. Next would be to consider antioxidants that specifically help prevent those environmental damaging factors, those free radicals and the classic ones to look out for is uh, vitamin A and vitamin C. These two are from SkinCeuticals. There's CE, Ferulic and Floretin, but Abaji have also got a really good uh, vitamin C, um, uh, the Pro uh, C range. And uh, with the advantage of the, the vitamin A or the retinol is not only is it an antioxidant, but it's also a cell stimulator. And that's the third thing that we need to include in our skin regime to help with that uh, 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 textured and, and rough skin. Uh, basically, it's what we call a skin booster. I would also recommend using a cleanser that exfoliates the skin, but uh, it, it, with the use of either alpha or beta hydroxy acid, so something like glycolic acid. Our creams, our moisturizers should also contain some form of exfoliant, something to improve that rough uh, textured skin, and that includes those with. Uh, glycolic and polyhydroxic acids. This one is from Dermacutic, known as Lightsutic, which not only contains alpha hydroxy acid, it also has a vitamin C complex again to help with that antioxidant and fighting the free radicals. And then the ultra smoothing cream from Neostrata uh, also contains alpha hydroxy acids. And finally, um, SkinCeuticals have the retexturizing activator. It's almost like a peel in a bottle, um, which will help to help smooth out the skin. Also containing um, acids as well as other ingredients to help uh, smooth the skin surface. And if all of this or this approach of the ingredients doesn't help, one may have to consider some form of light chemical peels such as a glycolic acid peel every four to six weeks to further aid or to help that rough uh, and, and uh, textured skin to become smooth again. I hope that that was helpful. Remember that you can always email me directly uh, or uh, take the face-to-face -face skin assessment where you can send a photograph of your skin and I can recommend products that are specific for your skin type and your skin concern. Thank you and bye-bye.